With the new guidelines, applicants are expected to visit any of the NIMSI offices closest to them during stipulated business hours of 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. effective from today, after which they'll be, uh, they'll be scheduled for an enrollment appointment. This is then followed by admittance into the office for a number issue in queue management system. The commission explains that the new process will reduce the population of enrollees at the center at every point in time and also ensure orderliness and strict adherence to COVID-19 protocols. What we are trying to do is uh, to adopt the booking system uh, that has been given to us from our, our headquarters. So what we'll do is uh, we'll uh, allow them to write down their names and they give them the dates that uh, they are expected to come back uh, for their registration because there's no way that we can attend to everybody uh, uh, on, on the same day. So by the time uh, we are through with the booking system, we'll give them the dates and uh, we'll expect that uh, they will come on the day that we have assigned uh, to each of them. The turnout has been very, very huge, very, very huge. And uh, we are trying our best to ensure that uh, we register as many as possible. Uh, on daily basis. Many people are not ready to listen to our instructions. We find out that uh, if we ask them to, to abide uh, with this rule, with this regulation, we just find out that most, of, most, most people are very impatient. That's the problem that we have. They are very, very impatient and they are not ready to listen to us. But we are trying our best to appeal to them that uh, the, the deadline has been pushed to, to, to February. So they still have ample time to register and there's no way we can register everybody on the same day. Meantime, some applicants who are still trying to get the national identity number are calling for an extension of the January 19 deadline set by the government for telephone subscribers to link their NIN numbers with their mobile phones. Some of them in Accra, the Ondo State Capital, Asaba in Delta State, and Ilori in Kwara State, who spoke to Channel Television, complained about the slow pace of registration and the huge population of enrollees. They are not sure an extension alone will fix the challenge and want government to open more centers to reduce the crowd at NIMSI offices. We the masses are suffering in this country. We the masses are suffering. The government said that we, they will be, uh, we should not, uh, we should not, we should be social discount. Look at people. This is supposed to be online. The government are suffering with people. Uh, you government, you should, you should put this thing online. Help us all. We have been here since throughout this week. They will say forge line, forge dish. We've been giving them the suggestion to bring number. They refuse. All they own is to write names, write names. At the end of the day, they will still allow people they know to enter. Why will we stay under this zone? They said there is corolla. We Nigerians, we believe there is corolla. But look at, look at the population. No social distance. Nothing to show. Why are they suffering us? Some people slept here. Some stayed here till three. And they are not attending to anybody. Some came since yesterday. It's frustrating.